During Russia's annexation of Ukraine's Crimea, Yuri Golovashchenko survived the betrayal of his superiors and his peers. He resisted the invaders and organized the defense of his unit against the Russian military. This video shows Yuri with his unit preparing for combat. When armed groups, which later became known as Little Green Men, invaded the Black Sea Peninsula, Yuri Holovashchenko began evacuating military personnel and their families. The country fed me for 20 years, the people fed me. I couldn't just say, well, I'll just go home and take a break. No, it's time to go to war. At the start of Russia's hybrid war in eastern Ukraine, Yuri served in the Airborne Division. Then he joined the Special Forces, and now he's the commander of an infantry brigade. I respect everyone. I value everyone. I think that everyone deserves a better life. Yes, I'm demanding. Yes, I'm tough. His unit holds the defense of the village of Piski, which is located in the suburbs of Donetsk. The Russian-backed militant forces practically wiped the settlement from the face of the earth. This is what the once wealthy suburb looks like now. They aren't afraid that they are going to be punished for shelling a civilian settlement. They understand that there aren't many civilians left here, so they keep shelling. The tall grass has hidden hundreds of craters made by enemy fire. Ukrainian soldiers follow familiar paths to avoid hidden explosives in the area. Here is a rocket from a Grad launcher. The Ukrainian military personnel say militant forces fire from residential districts of Donetsk. We are unable to respond in a similar way to these attacks, because more residential areas could be destroyed. Residential buildings with civilians, kindergartens or a children's hospital. The brigade commander admits that the war has hardened him. Only when he speaks about Crimea, his look softens and he seems to relax for a short period. There's a great longing inside me and I often reminisce about it. I really want to go there. I dream about that. I dream about the mountains. I dream about Perivalny in particular. Yuri wants to return home soon, but his main priority remains to defend Donbass against Russian-led forces. He said he'll protect the millions of Ukrainian families living near the combat line until peace has returned to the area.